Hey guys, how's it going? Well, I'm just getting up here uh, this fine Monday morning. Um, yesterday was the RVCon 2016 Recreational Vehicle Conference 2016. And um, so that's what the contents of this video include. So there's a couple things in here I... I I didn't have the, the camera out enough. I wasn't filming enough. So um, I got some good stuff, but I missed some stuff too. Um, specifically people. Um, Explore Steve and Dream Side Out were both there. And uh, I talked a little bit to Explore Steve, but I didn't really get a chance to talk to Dream Side Out. And I wish I, I would have been able to do that. But uh, Explore Steve was a really cool guy. And, um, he came in my van and, uh, checked it out and stuff. And he gave me a really good tip about, um, possibly using articulating arm to mount my heater on, which is a great idea because I didn't have to worry about the clearance issues. So I may very well do that. Anyway, um, this video is just going to be a collage of all the different clips. So I'm going to try to edit it a little bit to make it somewhat cohesive but uh, it's just going to be here and there I've had about three tours of vans and RVs and um, a few snippets here or there of people talking and stuff so the memory on my phone was running out so I, I couldn't get as much video as I wanted um, but uh, that's the way she goes anyway I hope you enjoy Well, here's the outside of uh, Justin's van. Class C, B+. Plus. If we look real close, maybe we can see his cat in there. Emmy. Emmy, are you in there? Extreme close-up. This, this, uh, Cage stuff is very strong. I like it. It's a really smart option. And there's his wood stove pipe. And it's not very, I mean, you, that solar panel's way up there. Not hiding nothing. Justin's plus my van is not awesome. Here we are in Justin Incredible's house. He's got scrubbing products, cheese puffs, salt and vinegar. Hey, kitty! Man, you look just like my old cat. Her name was Willow. Actually, it was a he. Hi! You're bigger than him. Hi, kitty. You stole me my cat. <laughs> if you were a girl, that would be <laughs> And there's the fabled stove. Kimberly. That's Justin laughing. It's got some nice vinyl. I don't know if that feels vinyl to me, not wood. Flooring. And he's got a very tight fit. See how his... Uh, the doghouse is very close to the front seat, so he's going to have a hard time squeezing between there. He probably just gets out and goes around. But that's always concern for me because I want to be able to get through my partition very easily. And he doesn't have a lot of insulation between the walls. It's just wood, actually. Huh. Maybe he had some in between, I don't know. Anyway, very nice. What is this setup? He's got a remote switch for his inverter. Big huge TV. Wow, the stove is right on the carpet stuff. Interesting. Big huge fridge. Cool, cool, cool. Let's check out the bathroom. Unless there's somebody in here. <laughs> 
This is my washroom. Keep it clean. Very nice. Bathtub area. He's got his uh, Reflectix in there. Lots of purple. Perfect. There you go. One sip and you're drunk. It's like Celsius. How many degrees Celsius is that? Somewhere in Fahrenheit. I think it's about six or seven times. You really when I'm on the road, I don't bother leaving it on because there's no point here. Thank you, sir. Watch your step. Yeah. Oh, this is a nice Mr. Buddy Heater. A little better than Gustin's, I think. It's a bit cramped, but it works. Cramped? It's huge no, compared to mine. Well, it's smaller than my 32 footer, obviously, but it's plenty. I like that it's got its own bed. It's got a dog bed, Sammy spot. How many feet? 23? 22.10. It's got a so TV on. I'll have to show you how, how, a, how a smart TV does its kind of washing. Yeah, I, I am thinking about upgrading. Nice. Microwave, food items. What is this? Uh, DVD Venture. It's got a built in DVD player. But that's probably hooked up. That's to uh, AC, so. That won't run. I don't, maybe. That's probably hooked up to an inverter or something. See behind there? No, oh, can't see. Huh. Cool beans, Daddy-O. Yeah, that's the AC. Let's see what's over here. Oh, a fridge. How oh, beautiful. And over here, the lovely washroom. I'm dressing. No, you're not. Wow, look at that. Nice sink, shower, toilet. Awesome. Check this out, guys. Another awesome van. This is a Ford V10, Triton V10. He's got uh, two 135 watt panels, so was that 100 and, no 270 watts of, pot of solar? It's a porta potty, the mother. It's a porta potty, yeah. It's not a porta potty. It was 110 bucks. Yeah. And it's the best they've spent. And you're really happy with the, the freezer? This, this is fucking awesome. Well, what is this one? This is a refrigerator. What's a brand of? Uh, grape Solar. Grape it's a 12 solar. volt. Oh, grape Solar? Grape Solar. Okay. Never heard of that one. Is there. that the manufacturer, really? Yeah, there's my. Oh, I'm yeah. saying it's. Digital maintains 40 oh, degrees. Really? I think they re remade one it's of the a, other kinds. It's kind of like kind. a winter. Like a winter, exactly. Yeah, it's pretty big, pretty much like, looks like, a, like winter a winter with a grape <laughs> solar decal on it. Yeah. <laughs> I think the winter, I, there was, I remember reading up on it and it is a little different. This thing is coming off the pivots. Mm -hmm. pivots. I got this base from a so RV store, the graveyard in Centralia. And this is kind of a test. I'm going to box it in and make it level and all that. But yeah, it's got a three burner stove, my sink, my fresh water and wastewater in that first cabinet underneath. And I still have a cabinet. There's tons of cabinet space. Got this set up here, she rack. Oh, yeah, those are cool. I run rope, I ran cable, I ran all kind of shit, and it always. Right. This. Ten dollars. Lots of tension, right? That's what does it. Yeah. And it's, you know, it expands. 
And you got a Max Fair, Max Air fan up there. Max, just like oh, uh, sweet guy over there. But mine, I don't have the remote. Were you an old surfer at one point in your life? Yeah. You, you kind of strike me as yeah, being yeah. one. Yeah, I'm from Florida. Okay. There so. you go. Yeah. What part? Uh, St. Augustine Beach. Oh, yeah. The oldest city. I lived in Tampa in the 80s. I've lived there. Uh, I've lived everywhere in Florida. Hillsborough Avenue. I'm just going to yeah. stick my yeah. head in here. Remember that? There was an old uh, Greyhound track right almost on the Pinellas uh -huh. County border. Uh -huh. That uh, built-in uh -huh. stove. Wow, that's nice. You, you like built that right into the track. counter, eh? Yeah. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah, that was, Sunday yeah, that's like a... Sunday. Sunday. I think that whole that both of those cabinets were just kitchen cabinets and it was like a hundred bucks. I was originally going to put it on the top, but I noticed when it gets hot, I use that 3M spray. Yeah. It kind of it it kind of bubbles like it sag. Well, this is the um, what do they call it? This is poly polyisocarbonate. Yeah. The poly yeah. 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 We're there. Behind the toilet, I've got little, it's like they're fake wood strips yeah. that I was going to put up. I was going to put the material up and then run run the strips on the beams to keep it in place. Huh. Ooh, that's some awesome new lighting, Nate. How long have you been? Wait, I'll see. How long has he been in this? I don't know. How long have you been in it? How long has this been yours? I don't think he heard you. A year and a half. Nice. It's about the same as me. Yeah. Nice fridge, though. Right? This is sick. Like, this is awesome. Thank you. Like, I know that you know that, but I, like, well, I mean, it's, it's my home. I love it. Yeah. It's my home. It's yeah. wicked. Nice storage. Like, I don't say that going into big... Mm -hmm. Like in suburban houses, I'm like, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's just like one next door, perfect. Yeah, nice. Yeah. <laughs> this is how I originally had my old van with the bed across the back on the side. On the side there, mm -hmm. what I found was because the streets are they're sloped yeah, yeah, down yeah. sideways for the yeah. the water runoff. So now you're sleeping like this. Yeah. yeah. Take that out. That will not fit sideways. But I could move things just because everything's just either. Screw to wood and floor, or I've got a uh, two by six running the link here and over there. Everything's just screwed in, so I can you can do it. Just unscrew it. Change if I want to yeah. change my setup. Mm -hmm. I just have to uh, like take that out and build a bed. But the only thing, the width of these, there's no mattress. You can't buy a mattress. You have to use foam. Yeah. Or apparently you can get RV beds. But I'm sure they're really expensive and not very good quality. <laughs> Knowing RV stuff. Yeah, exactly. Here we have all the RVs. There's a lot of them are left already. There's two, three over there. This cool little NV and that nice van. Cool stuff. Walking back to Canada. It's a beautiful night. A lot of cars going into Canada. Peace Arch Park. Thank you very much for your hospitality. So there you go, guys. RVCon 2016. Um, there was a lot more people there than I had on the video. I, I didn't start filming till later in the evening. Um, well, maybe not evening, but later on, probably around seven or so. And there was, uh, at the peak, there was probably around 40 people there, maybe 30 people there. Um, so, um, yeah, you're seeing a lot fewer people that were there, uh, later on. Um, anyway, it was great. A lot I really enjoyed it I'm definitely looking forward to going next year and uh, if you're in the Pacific Northwest or Vancouver or um, you know Northwest Washington or whatever you should come on down next year it's a lot of fun thanks for watching take care have a great night